Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Appa in case you guys are new here and I have a long awaited video for you. I'm finally getting the time to film this and today I have a huge semi-annual sale haul for you. I have two other small bags as well. So it's not just from one transaction, it is from two different transaction. Not all of this is like, you know, for me, some of these items are presents for other people as well i do want to talk a little bit about bath and body works you know customer service issue that i've had the past couple of days so some of you are subscribed to me because my very first video which was like six five years ago was a bath and body works collection video i got into bath and body works when i was like in high school i was 17 18 somewhere around that never since that it has been like my favorite store to shop at and you know I've had the rewards thing for a really really long time you guys I've ever since I was in college I had that because in the state of Indiana they followed the reward system in the state of Ohio it just was like recently you know introduced um, so I have been a member of that for a really long time I've done hauls and stuff not saying that I'm like affiliated with Bath and Body Works or and all that i'm not of, of course not i'm not and i'm not a big youtuber i don't always show you guys you know like all of the big stuff that they come out with like the land of sweets i didn't do a review on that and i think some of you guys understand that because i am a full-time graduate student and my finances you know they need to be really tight um and some of you guys really understand that and i really really appreciate so i i can't always do like the review of the new stuff i can't do the overnight shipping it's just as of now and at least for the next two years i can't just go out and just do that for the sake of youtube but i have been like like i said the rewards member for a long time they don't follow the reward system here in cleveland i don't know why like they accepted the points but the lady told me that they don't really accept the actual coupon and i was like okay that's like a little bit weird when i was in indiana i used to receive all of their 10 off um 40 or 30 or whatever coupon they had for the semi-annual sale they used to give it you know every time you would go to semi-annual sale as well and uh, their other sales and i just have not been receiving them and it has been a little bit disappointing and in a way i guess it was kind of good that i didn't receive the coupons because i probably would have purchased more items if i would have gotten the coupons but that is something i just wanted to point out um is that they're you know just their customer service has been a little bit weird and I did contact them about my coupons and they said that they're not sending them out anymore which I know is not true because every other person who has been hauling all of these stuff on YouTube here has received either the 25% off coupon and either the 10 off a 40 coupon i'm pretty sure so i don't know if it's because i didn't like shop you know for the past six months like ever since the semi-annual sale i did go there once and it was just for the five for six pocket bag and then i didn't go for any hand soap sales i didn't do candle day i don't know if that has anything to do with it but it just makes me a little bit upset because i do have the rewards thing with them and they are still you know not really sending me coupons and that's not really how a business should function i feel like and that's something i just wanted to tell you guys so i didn't have any coupons and my first transaction i did spend 55.05 dollars and yeah mostly hand soaps there are some body care items which i will talk about okay, so let's just go ahead and get started the first hand soap that i have here is in the deep cleansing hand soap and this is in frosted cranberry and that's kind of what that looks like keynotes for this one say 
frosted cranberry red delicious apple and blonde wood I actually did realize that I have a foaming in this already but it's okay that I got it in the deep cleansing and not the other one there's another one which is like a little bit rougher I can handle the deep cleansing and I can handle you know the foaming but the other one is a little bit rough for my hands but yeah I'm excited to use it even though I feel like my camera is having a hard time focusing yep yeah, but that's kind of what that packaging looks like and I'm excited to use that. The next hand soap that I ended up getting, okay, so the hand soaps were 50% off. That's the only item, 50% off, um, and also the wallflowers. I got some wallflowers as well, but everything else is 75% off. This is Berry Mary, Mary, Berry Mary, Mary Berry Kiss. And that's kind of what that packaging looks like really pretty blue packaging and I think this is um, just gonna look so cute I absolutely love the packaging the keynotes for this one says a winter berry snowy vanilla and crystallized ginger I don't remember smelling this one. Oh, this is you know it has that berry note to it but it's definitely not a sweet hand soap so if you like sweet scents I probably don't think you would like this one because this is not really sweet it is a little bit uh, misleading with the packaging and everything but it is a pine mixed with berry scent uh, very Christmassy so really excited for that the next hand soap that I ended up getting is sweater weather thank goodness I have been wanting to try this for the longest time and I feel like the flash sales which I missed had a better deal because they had the hand soaps I believe for $2.50 or was that the wallflower I don't even remember because I was so busy with school and the keynotes for this one say sage eucalyptus and fresh woods and that's what that looks like again really pretty packaging and I think I will definitely use this either during fall or winter and you guys know those are my favorite time of the year so that's that by the way the sweater weather is um, actually very similar to the berry I keep saying berry Mary kiss it's Mary berry kiss and it's very similar in terms of scent not as strong in the pine but it is a unisex scent in my opinion um, that's something I wanted to point out okay you guys so the next scent that I have here is the perfect autumn and that's kind of what that looks like keynotes for this one say fresh cranberry spiced pumpkin and crisp apple I really enjoy this scent and the packaging is just beautiful it is a strong cranberry oops there's I got some leak going on over there okay I'm gonna mess with that later but it is a good you know fall scent because it's pumpkiny it's cranberry and it has that cinnamon note to it you know what I'm talking about so really excited to use that next year and then I also have iced gingerbread that's kind of what that one looks like keynotes for this I just say some of the keynotes are like on the side I have to kind of look so this one says homemade gingerbread brown sugar and vanilla extract and that's what that looks like again mmm this this smells like gingerbread straight up gingerbread to me so um, gingerbread cookies so excited to use that for next Christmas and then I also have cinnamon pine cone really pretty packaging like they're from the same line you can tell um, because of the design I really like this packaging so the keynotes for this one say fresh pine cinnamon bark and juniper I have no idea what juniper is but again this is in that um, pine family I know some people don't like those types of scents but I like those types of scents for the bathroom especially I feel like they just kind of give that fresh note you know and even for the kitchen they're kind of good so excited to use that okay so the next hand soap is pumpkin cupcake absolute fave of mine keynote say baked pumpkin whipped vanilla frosting and golden honey I'm not gonna take this one out because I know exactly what this smells like it's a really sweet scent if you love baked sweet scents I think you would really enjoy 
pumpkin cupcake and it is a cult fave you guys so really excited to use that and then I also have marshmallow pumpkin latte which is always a repurchase for me really cute packaging I have to say they did a really good job with the packaging this year and I'm excited to use that one as well and then in this bag I also have a couple of wallflowers the first one that I have here is in Mary Mimosa I have never tried their wallflowers so I'm super duper excited to try them finally and keynotes for this one say sparkling champagne red apple slices and ice sugar crystals I can't exactly there is some scent um, to it and it smells good and it does give me a cinnamon apple vibe when I do that so excited to just try it I have never like I said I've never tried them before so I'm super excited and then the next one is cinnamon caramel swirl that's what that looks like the keynotes for this one say gooey caramel grated cinnamon and vanilla bean I can't exactly smell them so I'm just gonna have to like you know I guess try it and then see whether or not the centro is good the next one that I have here is in a chocolate lava cake I've heard a lot of people talk about this one so I'm excited for this and the keynotes for this one say scrumptious chocolate cake gooey cocoa center powdered sugared dusting so it's gonna be a good bakery scent, and you guys know that I love like my bakery scents the next one that I have here why do I have hair on my hand because I have hair everywhere that's the problem with having like a long hair anyways the next one is a cult wave as well well some people like it some people don't I like it so that is twisted peppermint and the keynotes for this one say cool peppermint sugared snow vanilla buttercream and sugared snow I think I read it wrong but twisted peppermint again and let's keep moving guys so that was the first bag first bags empty the second bag which is also from the same store so I did tell myself that I wasn't gonna you know get too much body care because you guys have seen my collection and you guys know I have a lot of body care so I wanted to try one new scent now my store had a lot of you know the land of sweets okay we had there was a lot of land of sweets but the problem with that I I did smell some of them and I actually did want the blueberry one but then when I smelled it in the store I was like okay this smells like something that I already have so that's why I ended up putting that one back if it is there next semi annual sale which I kind of doubt it would be because I feel like by the time next semi annual sale comes around they're gonna probably have another lotion or another um, line that everyone would be talking about at that point you know I'm kind of late with my game here with Bath and Body Works but I really wanted to try raspberry sugar so I ended up getting the lotion in this one keynotes for this one say sugared raspberries plum blossom and winter white lily mmm it's a really nice sweet fruit fruity raspberry sugary scent which is my go-to most of the time so I'm excited to use that and I ended up getting one body spray I have two more to talk about here but that's the body spray I got and I got the entire set because there was the entire set in my store along with you know a lot of like I said uh, land of sweet stuff and then I also ended up getting the shower gel because I like being matchy matchy so that was the body care new body care that I really wanted and then I got some shower gels because I have lotions in these already and I want to use up my lotions along with the shower gels I feel like that's kind of where I need to focus is that I need to use up what I have along with you know the matching shower gels I feel like that really helps me shrink my collection so the first one that I have here is wild Madagascar vanilla this was all 75% off guys the raspberry sugar was 75% off and um, yeah I think know what this smells like so I'm just gonna read you the keynotes to you and it is 
our exclusive Madagascar Vanilla Acorn African Pear Wild Jasmine White Sandalwood. It's just a really nice, sweet vanilla scent. Really appropriate for any time of the year, honestly. But I think um, a lot of people would like this for the winter and holiday time as well. And then, of course, I had to get you know hot cocoa and cream. I did see this. 475% off and like I said this was in the Land of Sweets collection so this is the only I think Land of Sweets stuff that I ended up getting and it's a really nice hot cocoa scent and the keynotes for this one say creamy cocoa mini marshmallows vanilla musk and I absolutely love this you guys I'm wearing like a color pop liquid lip it's like drying out my lips like crazy it is the older formula i still have the older formula i know that they have up their game with their formula recently which i haven't really tried but still making that liquid lipstick work even to this day okay so a new scent like i said that i wanted to try was a pink velvet cupcake so i did find this was in my second store so the first two bags that I just showed you guys they were from my main store which is like I said if you live in the Cleveland area it is in Beachwood Mall and then this one is was in Mayfield so this one is in pink velvet cupcake and that's what the shower gel looks like and then I got a matchy matchy um, fragrance mist and it's just so pretty it is one of those florals it is definitely a floral note um, I will say that and it's one of those uh, florals which I feel like I can probably wear and the keynotes for this one say sparkling berries whipped marshmallow sugared praline and it just is a very sweet berry with some sugar bakery note but it does have a little bit of floral note in it as well and i really wanted what i really wanted was a lotion to go with it but i couldn't find a lotion so i just ended up getting the body spray because i liked it you guys and <laughs> i know i have a lot of body sprays but i was really happy to find this because People were talking about it in the past and I was surprised to see it during the sale. The next item which I was really debating on but I really like the scent so much so I ended up getting it and this is in toasted praline pear. Toasted praline pear. That's what the packaging looks like. Oh my gosh you guys. This I think is going to be my new fall scent for the year <laughs> for 2020 even though this came out during 2019 i will use it more during 2020 so yeah definitely a fave of mine because it has a really nice sweet note and bakery note to it and i love scents like this and these fragrances i don't think they have keynotes so can't really read you guys the keynotes and then the rest items are mainly presents you guys so they also had their travel stuff for i think it was three for seven and they had them like in the front uh, near the counter so i actually ended up getting these for my mom's friends in indian culture we call them auntie just because that's that's just how it is and so two of my one of my mom's friend one of the aunties they live she lives in england and i was talking to her about you know bath and body works i don't know how much of a uk thing it is it might be but i think it's definitely more of a us and australia thing so i ended up getting marshmallow pumpkin latte for her and i got the marshmallow pumpkin latte in the mini along to go with it the body spray because it's just easier for my mom to like carry it in the flight all these like mini ones they did have you know the hand creams and stuff but then i thought about it i was like okay this is this hand cream is one ounce versus you know three ounces so i felt like economically this made more sense to me so that's the scent i got for her i already have marshmallow pumpkin latte in you know the pocket bag so we're also gonna you know add the pocket back to it from my collection and then for my second auntie who lives in new delhi india 
I ended up getting um, sweet cinnamon pumpkin. I think she would like this. She's also into scents and stuff like that. So that's for her. And then for my purse, <laughs> I ended up, so I really wanted the body spray in Twilight Woods. I couldn't find it. So I just ended up getting the mini lotion. I thought that was super duper cute. Ugh, I just love the scent for the fall time. It just screams fall to me. And yeah, that's the packaging is just really pretty with the blue. And then of course my vanilla bean Noel. How could I pass this? So I ended up getting that. So that is it, you guys. I know a longer video, but uh, I will probably edit quite a bit of this video. Let me know down in the comments below what was your like exciting find. I think the exciting find for me for the semi-annual sale was the toasted praline. I think I was that was like that was a jackpot for me. But I feel like they have done sales better before but i don't know for me like some semi-annual sales i'm disappointed other semi-annual sales i'm not i really wanted more candles but i just did not with the coupon situation i was just kind of like okay like i am not gonna get any candles i just like the ten dollar ones like i really wanted some of those and i was just like you know what i have wax melts i'll just use the wax melts and yeah, the whole coupon situation kind of put me off. So thank you so much, you guys, for watching. It really means a lot. Uh, like, comment, subscribe, all of that stuff. If you want to watch other videos, all of that would be towards the end. Thank you so much, you guys, and talk to you later. Bye.